Hi students, welcome to Shiju's educational channel. Today we are going to see the previous year questions of S2 Complementary Mathematics, BSc, CS, Physics and Chemistry. We will be discussing the questions from the chapter Hyperbolic Functions. Okay, let us start. Question, prove that tan h square x plus sec h square x is equal to 1. Tan h square x plus sec h square x is equal to 1. Okay. First we take the LHS. That is here LHS. LHS. Tan h square x plus sec h square x. That is equal to. We know that tan hx is equal to e raised to x minus e raised to minus x divided by e raised to x plus e raised to minus x. So we substitute here e raised to x minus e raised to minus x divided by e raised to x plus e raised to minus x. Whole square. Here tan h square x. So we put square here. Okay. Plus next sec h square x. We know that cos hx is equal to e raised to x plus e raised to minus x divided by 2. So we take its reciprocal we get sec hx. Okay. That is we write here 2 divided by e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square. That is equal to here e raised to x minus e raised to minus x whole square. That is we write e raised to x minus e raised to minus x whole square divided by here e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square. Okay. Then plus. Then 2 square. We know that 2 square is 4. 4 divided by here. We write e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square. Here the denominators are same. So we write in numerator we write e raised to x minus e raised to minus x whole square plus 4. Okay. We write e raised to x minus e raised to minus x whole square plus 4. Here it is of the form a minus b whole square. We know that a minus b whole square is a square minus 2ab plus b square. That is we write here e raised to x whole square. That is e raised to 2x minus 2 into e raised to x into e raised to minus x plus e raised to minus x whole square. That is e raised to minus 2x. Okay. Plus 4 divided by e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square. Okay. That is equal to we write e raised to 2x minus 2 into here e raised to x into e raised to minus x is e raised to 0 that is 1. So we write here 2 then plus e raised to minus 2x plus 4 whole divided by e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square. Here e raised to 2x okay then plus e raised to minus 2x. Then minus 2 plus 4, that is we get plus 2, divided by e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square. That is equal to v right. It is of the form a square plus 2ab plus b square. That is we write e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square, divided by e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square. Okay. This is get cancelled, we get 1. Therefore, tan h square x plus sec h square x is equal to 1. Second problem, prove that cos h square x minus sin h square x is equal to 1. We know that sin h x is equal to e raised to x minus e raised to minus x by 2 and cos h x is equal to e raised to x plus e raised to minus x by 2. So, we first take LHS that is here LHS cos h square x minus sin h square x equal to we know that the cos hx is this that is we write e raised to x plus e raised to minus x by 2 whole square minus sin hx here is e raised to x minus e raised to minus x by 2 whole square okay that is equal to we write here e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square by 2 square that is we write e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square divided by 2 square that is 4 minus here we write e raised to x minus e raised to minus x whole square divided by 2 square that is we write e raised to x minus e raised to minus x whole square divided by 2 square that is 4 
Here the denominators are same. So we take 4. That is in numerator we write e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole square minus e raised to x minus e raised to minus x whole square. This is equal to, we know that it is of the form a plus b whole square. Okay, here a is e raised to x, b is e raised to minus x. We know that a plus b whole square is a square plus 2ab plus b square. So we expand it, that is we get e raised to 2x, okay, plus 2ab. That is 2 into e raised to x into e raised to minus x. Plus e raised to minus x whole square, that is e raised to minus 2x. Then minus of. Here it is of the form a minus b whole square. We know that a minus b whole square is a square minus 2ab plus b square. So we expand it. Okay, that is we write using bracket here. e raised to 2x minus 2 into e raised to x into e raised to minus x plus e raised to minus x whole square. That is e raised to minus 2x. Okay, whole divided by 4. This is equal to we write e raised to 2x plus here 2 into e raised to x into e raised to minus x. e raised to x into e raised to minus x is e raised to 0. That is 1. So we get here 2. Okay. Plus e raised to minus 2x. Then minus e raised to 2x. That is we write minus e raised to 2x. Okay. Then negative into negative here is positive. 2. Here e raised to x into e raised to minus x. That is e raised to 0. That is 1. Okay. So we write here 2. Then negative into positive. We get negative e raised to minus 2x divided by 4. Okay. Here e raised to 2x and here e raised to minus 2x get cancelled. e raised to minus 2x here and minus e raised to minus 2x get cancelled. That is here 2 plus 2. We write 4. 4 by 4. That is 1. Now we get cos h square x minus sin h square x is equal to 1. Clear? Next fourth question. Show that sin h2x is equal to 2 sin hx cos hx. Sin h2x is equal to 2 sin hx cos hx. Okay. We know that sin hx is equal to e raised to x minus e raised to minus x by 2 and cos hx is e raised to x plus e raised to minus x by 2. Okay. First we take rhs. Okay. rhs here. 2 sin hx cos hx okay that is equal to 2 into here sin hx is e raised to x minus e raised to minus x by 2 okay into cos hx is e raised to x plus e raised to minus x by 2 okay then here 2 2 get cancelled we get this is equal to e raised to x minus e raised to minus x into e raised to x plus e raised to minus x whole divided by 2. Now it is of the form a minus b into a plus b. We know that a minus b into a plus b is a square minus b square. So here a is e raised to x, b is e raised to minus 2x. So we write e raised to 2x minus e raised to minus 2x by 2. This is equal to we write sin h2x that is LHS. Okay, now we get RHS is equal to LHS. Clear?